Welcome to Avantium's FDCA pilot plant, located at Brightlands Camelot campus in Helene. On this campus, there are 3,000 people, employed by 120 companies. The pilot plant houses 35 people of Avantium, which can produce up to 10 tons of FDCA per year. Welcome to the pilot plant. The FDCA is produced in a multi-step process, coming from a high fructose syrup or crystalline sugar, which will eventually be converted into a white powder called FDCA. This FDCA powder is the main ingredient for the fully plant-based and recyclable polymer material, PEF. This PEF has a much better carbon footprint than conventional plastics and also has a much better performance properties than, for instance, PET. PEF can be used for various applications, such as textiles or bottles, which you will find in the supermarket in the near future. The pilot plant doesn't run by itself. It is run by 15 operators who are working in shifts. The role of the operator is to maintain the quality of the product and to make sure all processes are running safely and as smoothly as possible. To check if the processes are running within the standard specifications, our laboratory has plenty of capabilities using a variety of analytical methods. Here we can check in all the steps of our production if our material is in the right properties to make an in-spec material. Whenever one of the components needs to be preventive or correctively repaired, exchanged or removed, this job is executed by maintenance, who will make sure our plant will be up and running as reliably as possible. To improve the process, the technologist will dive into the details. Managing safety and environmental risks is no different from a commercial plant, and work processes like hazard identification, management of change, and permit to work are adhering to industrial standards. The pilot plant functions as a bridge between the laboratory, situated in Amsterdam, and the commercial scale-up flagship plant, located in Delft Cell, where the laboratory has the possibility to test situations, mostly in a small batch process. Things get quite hard to translate when going to a continuous commercial scale process. By trying to replicate the results from the laboratory, the pilot plant functions as a crucial intermediate before sending the process to the flagship plant. Problems like mixing, flowability, or heat transfer are more emphasized opposed to the laboratory setups. Where the pilot plant has advantages in terms of cost, flexibility, and training personnel, it is too small to serve our customers. Our much larger FDCA flagship plant in Delft Cell does have the capacity to foresee clients with material. Apart from the development of FDCA, the pilot plant in Helene will also venture in the polymerization of PEF. By using bio-based monoethylene glycol, together with our own FDCA, we will be looking to perform research and development on the polymerization of PEF, in which we can offer more knowledge to our customers who will be wanting to market the FDCA and PEF. On the campus location, the pilot plant has close connections with other companies who offer additional knowledge. Companies like SciTech and Profcore are easily approachable and a face-to-face -face meeting is never too much to ask. We believe in a fossil-free world. Will you join us in our mission to help transition the chemical and plastics industry into a fossil-free future? Let's go!